Now, it was a crime that shocked France. A 16-year-old Roma gypsy boy beaten to within an inch of his life, dumped in a shopping trolley in one of Paris's poorest neighbourhoods. The boy, known as Darius, is in a coma and fighting for his life. President Hollande called the attack unspeakable and unjustifiable, but the case has shone a light on the plight of the 20,000 Roma who are living in France, many in desperately squalid conditions. Viewers may find some images in Matt Fry's report distressing. Paris in high season. The tourists throng the iconic sites in the centre of the city and the scammers work the crowd looking for easy prey. The latest one involves donations for a fake charity. Here, an American tourist is persuaded to part with 10 euros. The women from the charity are dressed like the tourists. The idea is to blend in. When they notice us filming them, they melt away swiftly, camera shy. They all belong to the Roma community, gypsies from Romania who've settled here. They've always been down and out in Paris, but now they're down, out and afraid. This is one of the 40 or so camps around Paris the Roma call home, where power lines, dormant ones, double up as swings. A cramped hive of humanity clustered between an office block and the wrong side of the railway tracks. Bonjour. Ça va? So look at this, it's an amazing warren of shacks, huts, camper vans. This is one of the biggest Roma camps on the outskirts of Paris, and it's like a little city in its own right. Bonjour, ça va? but no electricity and no running water. And everywhere you look, supermarket trolleys, the vehicle of choice for a community of urban castaways living on society's cast-offs. The trolley is an iconic Roma symbol, which is also, one assumes, why it was chosen as a prop in an horrific crime. This was 17-year-old Darius on the 13th of June, left for dead after being beaten and tortured. His jaw had been dissolved with battery acid. France was in shock. Deux photos choc sur lesquelles on voit le visage tuméfié de Darius. Là, President Hollande massacré, called it an unspeakable crime. Ion Fardo is a Roma mechanic who's been living here for eight years. He runs a car garage next to the camp where Darius used to live. Uh, ici, avant, j'ai les Darius qui habitaient ici, à côté, juste à côté habité. In his office, he told me how he had discovered the boy in the trolley. Perica de Bruj era foarte desfigurat, arăta într-o formă gravă. Am încercat să vorbesc cu el, nu putea scoate nicio vorbă, era capul lui deformat, umflat în în mai multe părți. Doar că un pic mai sufla pe gură. The Roma camp from which Darius was taken was on a busy road next to a tram line, a short commute from the center of Paris. The attack happened early evening at the height of the rush hour and it was brazen. Foarte mulți bărbați mascați cu pistoale, cu puști și cu săbi și cu tot felul de arme. Uh, au blocat strada și au pătruns în vecinătatea mea aici în uh, unde locuiau When we visited the camp the bulldozers had already moved in to flatten what had been a home to over 200 people on someone else's land So by the end of the day this entire place will have been flattened by that bulldozer and as you look around into what were people's homes after all you can tell that everyone who lived here left in a hurry. Come and look at this. A half-eaten meal left on the plate, now somewhat mouldy. I mean, this would have been a home for an entire family. And what you've always got to remember is that this squalor exists on the outskirts of Paris. Darius is still in hospital, still in a coma. So we went in search of his family at the new camp they had fled to. 
Interdit quoi? They weren't very happy to see us. Vas-y. Oui, oui. J'ai téléphoné avec. Vec, 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 vec. OK, OK, OK. One reason for their aversion to the camera may have been that Darius was well known as a thief. OK, 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 OK. OK, OK, all right. OK. We made our excuses and left. The people Darius stole from and the people who punished him for it live in a place called the City of Poets, one of Paris's more notorious housing estates where everyone has forgotten which poets they had in mind when they named this collection of tower blocks, but where there is plenty of poetic license in the clash between real estate posters and reality. The police are nowhere to be seen, the gangs are in charge here, and the only people who weren't afraid to talk to us about Darius were a group of schoolgirls. Mais ils sont venus euh, une cinquantaine de bien bah, bien mais mais, mais, mais est-ce que tu as mais est-ce que tu as vu l'image de, de ce garçon non, presque tu es c'est incroyable tu mais, as vu l'image non mais en fait c'est parce que c'est parce que euh, j'aurais pas dû voler ouais et en plus quand ils lui ont demandé de rendre les choses ils voulaient pas donc je pense que ça les a énervés ah. oui c'est pas que justifie leur euh, pas que justifie ah oui c'est ça leur, euh, leur euh, geste mais euh, je les comprends un peu parce que on en oui. a marre du vol aussi The Roma families that knew Darius have scattered to other camps. They're living in fear and in the shadows without any protection from the French authorities. We met seven-year-old Yasmina, who, like so many Roma children, was born in France, but does not live the life of a French child. Bonjour, je m'appelle Yasmina. Je voudrais te dire, ici c'est ma maison, et en plus, euh, on n'a pas de l'eau, on n'a pas du manger. Euh, C'est là qu'on habite et on, on, on plus. Yasmina's family have lived in France for 15 years, but they continue to exist on the margins. Since there's no power, they cook with an open fire inside a shack made from cardboard boxes. You can imagine the fire hazard. Her mother gave birth to Pavel a month ago, but she complains about the lack of help from a state that prides itself on leaving no one behind. J'ai besoin de produits pour le cordon du bébé, j'ai besoin de lait, j'ai besoin de couches. Je ne veux pas qu'il continue sa vie comme moi. The Eiffel Tower is only 10 miles from the city of Poets housing estate or the Roma camp that was raided. But they might as well be on different planets. The fact is that France has become a multicultural society of immigrants more by default than by design. And as a result, the many minorities living in this country, be they Arab, African or indeed Roma have only been caressed by France but never fully embraced by it. And that is the root of so many of the country's problems. As someone who is born here, she deserves better. And as someone who almost died here, so does he. Matt Fry in Paris.